Greetings. This is a planetary alignment and earthquake watch for May 20 through 25, 2016. Significant planetary alignments taking place during this period involving Mars, which will be at opposition of Sun and Venus within three days of each other, highlight this time period as extremely volatile, which may foreshadow the potential of one or two earthquakes registered over 7.2 magnitude. We're now looking at the important astronomical events that will be taking place for the month. We see on May 9, Mercury will be at inferior conjunction. The important Moon-Jupiter conjunction taking place on the 15th. The 18th, the Moon will be at apogee. But the important time frame, May 22nd, Mars will be at opposition. And May 25, the Venus will also oppose Mars, highlight this period as highly volatile. And I am suggesting a very powerful earthquake or a significant uptick in seismic activity felt here on the Earth during this time frame. It is worth noting that the Moon will be at maximum strength during the month of May, where on May 6 it will reach its third nearest approach to the Earth for the year, all classified as a supermoon. Now it is worth mentioning that in April was also a supermoon, the Moon's second nearest approach to the Earth for the year, and we had a rapid increase in seismic activity felt here across the Earth. This may be the case again in May, we could see another increase in strong earthquakes registered over 7 magnitude, so it's definitely a time frame we all need to watch and monitor. The month of May represents a fairly volatile period, where the lunar influence will be extremely strong. Now continuing on with the lunar influence, there are two windows that I've highlighted which may be significant for the month. From May 8 through 15 could see significant shaking and also the time period for this video, May 20 through 25, could see a very powerful earthquake felt on the Earth registered over 7.2 magnitude. This is mainly due to significant simultaneous lunar interactions between Mercury, Venus and Mars taking place from May 20 through 21. We're now going to look at the exact overhead or longitudinal position of the Moon at the time of both lunar apogee on May 18, and also the lunar declination on May 24, which will be occurring around this watch period before and during. The position of the Moon at the time of these events may imply an ocean-based event for the month, with key areas of focus being at high latitudes, with areas of focus being the Norwegian Sea, the southern Alaska region, or possibly southern hemisphere around the Bouvet Islands, south of Africa, or the Pacific Antarctic Ridge. And finally wrapping up the lunar influence, the important Moon-Jupiter conjunction taking place on May 15. Now the last 14 Moon-Jupiter conjunctions have produced all coincided with four earthquakes registered over 7 magnitude. Now looking at May 20 astrologically, and a closer look reveals significant planetary geometry. Not only do we have the Jupiter-Neptune opposition taking place, but Mars will directly oppose the Sun-Venus conjunction, highlighting this time period as extremely dangerous for powerful earthquakes here on the Earth. Not only do we have two powerful opposition of the planets taking place for May 20, but the Moon is also involved briefly with an opposition of its own with Mercury. This will take place on the same day, highlighting this period as highly volatile. There are important astronomical aspects taking place during this time frame as well. We have a very strong grand trine taking place between Mercury, Jupiter and Pluto, just over 2 degrees of separation. A kite formation is triggered off by the Moon involving the same planets, Again, just two degrees of separation separates these planets, Mercury, Jupiter and Pluto, aspect that all triggered off with the Moon. The Moon is involved again this time in a rectangle geometry with planets Jupiter, Mercury and also Neptune. This is extremely significant, two potent interactions with the Moon, and perhaps the strongest of them all, the aspect or T-square between Jupiter, Saturn and Neptune highlights this time period as highly volatile, less than two degrees of separation between these planets, should provide the foundation for a strong earthquake felt here on the Earth registered to around 7.5 magnitude. We note that the position of Mars will be of key influence during this month, but also Venus as well, as it will be directly opposed, heading behind the Sun during this time frame. Now the important Venus-Mars oppositions have coincided with strong earthquakes in the past. Here is a list of them since 2004. And now for the earthquake forecast. The number one area of concern will be northern Peru or central Peru for this watch for a potential 7.2 magnitude earthquake. This could also be a potential for an aftershock for Ecuador. The geodetic positions of both Neptune and Jupiter will be the second areas of concern. This will be for India or Nepal, or the Aleutian Islands, Kodiak Islands, Alaska region. And my third area of concern will be the Iceland region or surrounding regions of Jan Mayen Island or Norwegian Sea. Please note that all images and templates in this video are provided in the monthly website newsletter available at solarwatcher.net. It is also worth mentioning that May 31st into June 1st represents another significant time period. 
we have a grand trine taking place and also coinciding into a grand cross between Sun, Jupiter, Saturn and Neptune. Very significant and well worth noting. And that concludes this planetary alignment and earthquake watch for May 20 through 25, 2016. For more information, please visit solarwatcher.net where there will be more content for members and subscribers as well as a website newsletter. And there is a free website newsletter forecast for the New Zealand region for the rest of 2016. Annotations and results of this watch will be added at the end of this video. Thanks for watching.